This is, uh, I think, really different than the conventional daycare because all the parents and all the teachers are members and make all the decisions about the center. You're helping, you're helping us build this stool. I think maybe one of the reasons that Seward is so genuinely successful at inquiry has to do with the co-op model. Because just a co-op model says, you know, everybody here has something valuable to say. Everyone considers this their place, um, and we kind of are all partners in what happens here, including the children. Like, everyone gets to say it. So anything major that happens in the center is voted on by all the members. Cooperative is, is in the most basic terms, is, is a, a voluntary organization of either consumers or producers that band together to use their shared strength to gain capital resources that they may need, and then also you gain the market strength of being able to ne negotiate for fair prices. Minnesota is the largest state to, for cooperative development. Four of the, of the top ten largest cooperatives in the country are based in Minnesota. So it is huge. This is, you know, we have Fortune 500 companies that are member owned. There's actually an African saying, it roughly translates to, if you want to go fast, go alone. If you want to go far, go with friends. And that's, kind of, that's one of the ways that a co-op works really well. We do all of our decisions in consensus process, you know, one, one worker, one vote. Cooperatives that care about their communities are anchored in the communities. And that is where I think this is so important for Minnesota to use these models for uh, future development.